We're going to be breaking down the lyrics to my next stop on MM Lyrics. Shout out to Mixtape Madness. So I started off with my first couple videos on Instagram. Shout out, I'm just baited to help me get noticed and get viral. And from there, one thing led to another. And you know, from there, just been working hard, putting in the work. And yeah, it's take off. I grew up in the south of the town where beef starts to spread and death comes about. Fence start to go and feds come around. There's nowhere to go apart from the ground. Right, so basically, I wanted to talk about um, the lifestyle that I came. So basically, where I came through. Basically, where, where I'm from in South London, there's just bare violence and, you know, just negative things normally happen in my area. It's not really positive things. But I'm just trying to make a point throughout this next stop that I'm better than that and I'm just trying to do something better than that. We didn't have no peace to touch. I was only little, I didn't know much. No father figure, smiles and pictures. I'm working hard, it's all for my mum. I grew up in a single mother home. So it's just me, my siblings and my Marge. So basically, I'm just trying to say that my mum brought me up and stuff. And obviously just being, not having a father figure, obviously I can still do it on my, on my own kind of thing. Because what I'm getting, obviously I'm helping. Like, don't worry, don't worry, I, I help, I help, don't worry, I help. She would work so hard for a fiver to cool up her mum on every tree I with the like her. That's why I'ma make it up. Hope you know I'ma take it up. Trying to stack all my paper up. Hope you know I'ma take it up. Put a middle finger at a hater cause they don't understand the way that I came through cause. Obviously, man's every train if you didn't know. East Africa, come on. Uh, me being every, every train, my mum had to always, you know, like, well, obviously every time that she would work or whatever, she always had to, always had to save money and stuff to send her family back home, as like my, fa like they weren't, they they're not living the best, you know what I'm saying? So she's just helping them, and she's always having to call on the like her, to call, you know, internationally and stuff like that. So yeah. They don't understand the way that I came here. Only made a couple bands on my revelation. I just prayed to the Lord and had patience. This year is all about elevation. Uh, this year, just trying to achieve bare greatness. Like, this year's been a good year, I'm not gonna lie, so far. And shout out to M. Huncho for that, that bar, Elevation. Uh, this year, I dropped a single with my boys, AJ and EO, called London. But it's just, it's changed our lives, like it's, it's mad. Got about, 13 million views so far. Obviously, I dropped this next start, which is doing numbers as well, a couple million. Um, just dropped something with Cadet, that's doing crazy as well. So this year's just elevation, elevation, and there's 100% more to come. Shut down Westfield, cause I can do. No doubt on my ones, I'm a man though. No, I ain't no average civilian. 13, I banged my first million views. Might recognize from the videos too. Went from a school youth to a cool youth. Sang a couple tunes, now I'm making them moves. Still going to school, I'm a little cool youth. I went to Westfield. When I said that bar, uh, shut down Westfield, cause I can do. It wasn't even about buying nothing. It was about how we, well, me and AJ done our first video shoot for No Me. Um, we told everyone to come to Westfield for a big link up slash video shoot kind of thing, and it was just pff, ram like the whole like Westfield literally got shut down that day. So that's why I said shut down Westfield just because I can though. Yeah. Everything I say will be a wave. Smiles on my face, my tunes in the rave. No more else starting from today. Only going up, can never downgrade. Trying to get my people out of the slums, but keep the respect, cause that's where I'm from. The real south side of London, where all this shit just has to go bang, bang, bang. The ends are just, uh, it's just, it gets hectic. But you know, that's what I'm trying to say. Like, you always hear about people dying and stuff going on. It's just the kind of thing where I'm just like, why, like, just allow it, kind of thing, you know what I'm saying? I don't understand, stand, stand. It's all going mad, mad, mad. When you tell me they're gone, it's all gone wrong and they won't come back, back, back. How can they just leave like that? How can they just leave like that? When you tell me they're gone, it's all gone wrong. I just know a lot of people that have been through some mad, mad shit. Like, people have been through problems and violence and you know, hospitalizing, it's just bad, it's bad, like nonsense, and it's for dumb reasons as well. So I'm just trying to, just like, again, like, why, kind of thing, you know what I'm saying? 
I'm just trying to get away from here. Make my bread and disappear. You can't make success appear. You gotta work that shit up there. Through the ups and downs, I can't shed no tears. Keep my head up and show no fear. Keep it up till the coast is clear. You gotta work that shit up there. Through the ups and downs, I can't shed no tears. Keep my head up and show no fear. Keep it up till the coast is clear. You gotta work that shit up there, yeah, yeah. So seeing the people that come from my area, like Crepton Conan, Stormzy, Young, and people like that, to see the heights that they've reached is just mad. And I know that soon I'll be up there too.